One from the vaults here for you today. I've had this for a few years now. It's Blues Pills' second album, Lady in Gold. Came out in 2016. It's 40 minutes long. And uh, they done this box set. Really nice box set. And uh, some brilliant, brilliant artwork. The artwork is a Dutch artist called, uh, and I'm going to butcher this, so please apologise. Uh, accept my apologies it's Marike Koga Dunham and uh, she done some work with the Beatles and with Cream in the past amongst many others so a well established artist so it's you're getting you're getting some bona fide artwork here fantastic okay lovely colours great looking artwork and on the back we have a list of the contents. So it comes with the um, CD and a picture disc on vinyl. Now you know me about picture discs. I've mentioned it in my last video I've done. And we have Blues Pills live in Berlin 2015 on DVD. And then and you also get it on CD as well as the album on CD. Live, fantastic. This is where Blues Pills, to me, really comes to the fore, is when they're alive. So to get this in here is a real bonus and well worth watching. Okay, let's have a look inside then. So it comes with a poster. And I will try to show you this the best I can. It's a lot of the artwork in here. It's quite repetitive as such. It's it's following the theme of the album. But it's um it's a nice it's a nice poster. <laughs> um <clears throat> if you know what I mean it's 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 very arty and uh it's pity it hasn't come like in the old version that you know, oh, hey I've told you a thousand times crease posters and me nah, doesn't work but um it's a nice piece to have with the box set. Also came with the nice print of the band. Excuse me, upside down. Nice print of the band. It was the last um, album with a guitarist, Dorian Soro. Um, he left to do a solo career and um, it was an amicable parting of the ways and uh, as far as I know they're all good friends and he's pursuing a, a career that he wants to do he wants to do his own thing and that's fair enough okay so it comes with the um, live in Berlin the DVD um, can't remember how long this is exactly uh, but it is well well worth a watch as I said when Blues Pills play live and I went and saw them a few years ago down in Camden Palace it was a great show and um, they go into great jam sessions and extend their songs and uh, that's to me the sign of a good band and that's where they really shine is in their live sets came with the CD as well remember I get this out here there we go came with the CD as well I say just replicating the artwork again but see you've got the CD version of live in Berlin with it as well as the Lady in Gold album now the Lady in Gold album I wasn't I wasn't taken by it at first but there are some great tracks on there and over the years it has actually grown on me and I quite enjoy playing it now. But when I first heard it, compared to the first album, uh, not disappointed, but it was different. They, they took a different sort of avenue. Uh, but as I say, with, with more playing in that, I did grow to quite enjoy this album. Got the regular booklet with it. Again, repeating the artwork. 
there's some nice pictures of the band in there. Oh, your lyrics. Quite simple, quite straightforward booklet. Nothing too fancy. They quite they do a lot of these cases. Um, I quite enjoy. I quite like these cases. That are the hard case with the uh, the format fitted in these. It's quite a nice way of keeping them, and they last quite a long time. Also came with. For those with you with a turntable who will recognize one of these, one of these carbon brushes with lady in gold on it. Um, I haven't used it, just kept it in as a little collectible inside the box set. As I said, I did go see them at uh, Camden Palace a few years back and I managed to pick up their autographs on a signed card, which was nice to have. I say that was the last time Dorian Sorrow was in, was in the band before they went on to make their third album. Just some, they do some nice t-shirts as well. They really do some nice um, 70s retro t-shirts. And finally, we come to the vinyl. I say just, just replicating the artwork. Really nice inside. Nice gatefold. There's this sheet here that comes inside with the lyrics on, but uh, the picture disc. It's one of the nicer picture discs I have. Great colours. That's a lovely picture disc. Great look. See, I don't play it. I didn't even bother because uh, picture discs and me have um, I've not picked up any that ever really sound good. I'm just happy playing the CD, but it's a really nice collectible piece to have. Okay, I hope you enjoyed looking through this. Oh, the deal in this, I was going to let you know how much is, just now, I had a look around before I did this video, and I had a look, the best deal, and you can get a really good, good deal in this just now, if you go to Nuclear Blast's website, that's nuclearblast.com, you can pick this up just now. For twenty three ninety nine uh, ninety nine cents in euros, which is around about twenty one pounds UK. And if you've seen the price of uh, vinyl these days, to get the vinyl, the CD, the poster, the print, obviously not the signed autograph. That was something extra I just popped in there, and everything in this really nice our box set for 21 quid or 23.99 euros it's a great deal i think and uh well worth investing in okay all the best for now hope you enjoyed this till next time see ya bye